effective police officer starts with six months of training and more than 900 hours of instruction. That's what gives cops an edge over most criminals. But what happens when an outlaw is just as skilled as your officers, or in extreme cases, even more skilled? Madison County, Montana. Traffic on state standby The man racing down these winding roads is George Davis. A peace officer's nightmare. Not only did Davis shoot seven civilians and one cop in a drunken rampage, he's also a paramilitary trained killer who served as a mercenary in Nicaragua. Trooper Jason Hildenstab knows he has to stay on the bumper of this black ops specialist. 396 mile marker 10. But Davis knows that in the art of war, nothing beats a tactical surprise. He stands on his brakes triggering a violent rear-end collision that leaves the cruiser disabled. Davis leaps from his car and takes a sniper position at the rear bumper. With Hilden's staff hiding behind his cruiser, Davis drills his engine block, releasing a wall of steam. Deputy Dave Conway catches up and sees his partner in a violent shootout. He leaps out, putting his 12-gauge into action. But the killer is already using the smoke screen to make his escape. Hildenstab abandons his car and jumps in with Conway. It seems these mountain cops know a thing or two about war themselves. Do we have any county cars in that area? And they're calling in their frontline troops. We've got several headed that way. It's about to be one rogue gunman against a small battalion. As neighboring Idaho adds some serious stopping power. Nope, I'm gonna throw them out. Placing spike strips could leave these cops in the crosshairs of the assassin. Get ready to get the hell out of the way though, because we don't know what he's gonna do. But taking that chance. They're coming! Watch out! Pays off. And when the military man spins out, Conway gives him more than a dishonorable discharge. Davis screeches to a halt and readies his gun. But the automotive offensive can't be stopped with bullets. His weapon goes flying and the murderer is left battered and barely conscious. Trooper Hildenstab is also injured in the crash. Stay down now. Stay down. Right here. Right here. But he'll recover. Stay down. And George Davis will spend the rest of his life Put your hands outside the door. Right now. behind bars. When this violent paramilitary vet snapped, he had all the know-how to be a one-man killing machine. But these Montana cops proved to be the one enemy he couldn't conquer.